Tell you more about trees in a moment. The one-two pitch. Swing and a miss. Strike three. One ball and two strikes. Check swing. He went around. Strike three. Dominic Wolf knew it. Hard cuff runners on first and third. Two outs. Top of the first. No score. The pitch. There goes Sanchez. The breaking ball is strike three called. And it doesn't matter. The inning is over. Treasel strikes out the side. Intensity is here. Here's the 3-2 pitch to Brockmeyer. Hit off the end of the bat towards the right center field alleyway. Auernhammer, a long run. He's not going to get there. It lands for a base hit. Runner going. Swing and a miss. And the throw to second base is not in time. However, Hughes is 1-2. Line drive right field, and it is going to drop in front of Erickson. Coming around is Brookmeyer. He's going to be waved to the plate and score. Erickson pulled up at the last moment. And he swings, and it's a fly ball to right center field. Erickson is going back. The runners are tagging. Erickson has a play. He makes the catch. Here's the throw to third base. They've got a chance to throw the tag. He is out. It's a double play. And that will end the inning. Erickson. Here's the 0-2. Tap weakly on the ground towards third. Dominic Wolf has it. He's got a lot of time to throw to first. Then he does in time, and the inning is over. 5-3 on the putout. It's one out, nobody on top of the third. Fastball strike three called. Leighton not happy. But the Har fans sure are. Here it comes. Grounded to the left side and it get past everybody into left field, a base hit. Past the dive of Wolf and past the dive of Daniel Sanchez. A little now he comes set and deals. There's a line drive into center field, a base hit. And Hughes angry at himself. He knew he left a fat fastball over the center of the plate and Richie Klein did not miss it. And a four pitch walk loads the bases. With the exception of Steffens in left field, who is playing very shallow. And there's a high drive to deep center field. Going back is Goods. He's going to probably make the catch. Tagging from third is Auernhammer. He's going to score. The throw goes to third base. The play is out at third base. The run scores. The game is tied, however. The throw to third. Oh, the game is not tied. They're going to say the run does not count because the out at third was made before the run crossed the plate. So Ziegler flies out. Let's take a look at this on the replay. Does the runner from third score before the out at, th at uh, third? Uh, it looks to me like the out at third was actually before the run crossed home plate. It looked like a good call. There's a 1-2. Breaking ball. Soft line drive to center field. Drops for a base hit. Nils Hardcuff leads things off with a little jam shot. Up. Ball four. Three and one. Ball four. Treasel missing badly. And now the bases are loaded. Hart lead one nothing. The 2-0 pitch. Fastball strike. A throw behind the runner. And he is out. They got a pickoff play at first. Daniel DeBacco right there. And Sasha Steffens has been picked off. There are two outs. What a huge play. Oh, and Hughes, the runners on second and third. Here's the 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Kevin Treasel, with the help of Jose Palacios, escapes a huge jam. And the inning is over. Solingen does not score. There's Josh. Line drive. Base hit. Left center field. Over to get it is Florian Goetze. Josh with a first pitch single. And leave the park. And he rips a line drive, base hit down the right field line. Peterson, almost hit by the line drive, has to hold up and only go to second base as the right fielder, Brockmeyer, retrieves it and fires it into the infield. One in this game. And Erickson lays the bunt perfectly down the third baseline. It's a beauty. Wolf fields and throws one play to first in time. Erickson, another threat for the Disciples, the pitch. Line drive, caught with a jump by Dustin Hughes, a little squibber off the end of the bat. Looked like it might be high enough to get over Dustin Hughes, but he actually made the play rather easily. Two and one to Auernhammer, the pitch. Pop fly ball to short right field, racing in Brookmeyer. He pulls up and he has a play and he makes the catch and the inning is over. Both sides, here's the pitch. There's a line drive down the left field line, base hit all the way into the corner. Nico Licci with a long run to get it. The ball caroms around. And he grabs it on the warning track. Florian Goods in easily with a stand-up double on the first pitch. On base, creating havoc. There's the pitch to Leighton. Breaking ball in the dirt. And this one skips away from Palacios. Goes all the way to the backstop. And Florian Goods will take third easily on a wild pitch. Beer for the Alligators. 2-1.
Fly ball to left field and deep. Nicolici going over towards the line, makes the catch. Goods will come home and score. So it'll be a sacrifice fly and a run batted in for Tanner Layton. The score is now 2-0 Solingen. Who's thrown out at third base in that inning, that end of the inning. And he lines one to right field, tailing away from Brookmeyer. Long run. He'll never get it. It's in there for a base hit. And it goes all the way to the corner. Klein is trying for two. The throw is not in time. A double. He was working from the stretch and the pitch. Line drive over to the jump of Tanner Layton, a base hit to right field, and Klein scores, it is two to one. Tanner Layton looked like he almost had a chance to catch that ball. I wonder if he might. One ball and two strikes to count to him. Line drive over at Siegler's leap and into center field. A base hit for Niels Hardcup, his second of the game. He does not show bunt, and he swings away and hits a liner off of Peterson's glove. Siegler. Scrambles to field it, and he's going to have no play. Josh, who was playing in, looked like he had that ball, and it just hit off the heel of his glove. and Misses that line drive, and Hughes shows bunt, and he lays it down the third baseline. Perfect bunt. It rolls and stays fair. Peterson picked it up and stepped on the bag, and Patrick Meister calls safe. That would have been a force play. Josh is thinking that it was definitely there before Hardcuff made it to the bag, and Mitch Stefan is over to argue. But the call is safe, and everybody is safe, and the bases are loaded. Just loaded, nobody out. One ball to count to Sasha Steffens. Pop fly, short right field. This is trouble, and it's going to land fair for a base hit. Everybody will move up. It's a run for Soling, and they lead 3-1. to one. Coming home to score is Nils Hartkup. The pitch. Ground ball. Up the middle, into center field, a base hit. In comes Brookmeyer. The other runner will be held at third. The throw comes into the plate. It is to 4-1, Soling. In. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss on a pitch in the dirt. Palacios can't find it. The runners, however, not moving. Now the runner coming to the plate. Shoveled to Treasel, and it's kicked away. And one run has scored. Now a second run is going to come to the plate. The throw to Palacios is saved at the last minute. Two runs have come home to score. It is 6-1. to one. The strikeout, however, is completed. Goetz is out because first base was occupied. However, two runs score on a wild pitch. Hughes the first and Steffens the second. There's a swing and a miss, strike three. Auerhammer goes down on three pitches. Gildan goes in the D.H. Rufio Schultz's spot. And he swings and misses. Six straight strikes and two strikeouts. A 2-1 game. It was a big hit with two outs. Swing and a miss at a big off-speed breaking ball. Nasty pitch from Marquez and finding the run. Here's the 3-2. Swing and a miss for the second out. And here's the 1-2 pitch. Grounded to the hole, and a nice diving stop by Wolf. He spins and throws to first, and it is scooped nicely by Hughes. The throw is in time, and the game is over. Solingen wins by a score of 7-1. to one.